Avengers Assemble. What a fun day to be on the franchise line of what Square Enix has finally crafted to be something that's a little bit whole nowadays. Now, my name is Mac here at the MacGyver 7 channel, and today we're going to be looking at what the brand new patch that just rolled out. Yes, we are looking at 1.44. This also accompanies into the level threat for the family reunion that's on the 27th. We got to double down for as far as what's going down. So let's go ahead and scroll into it and see what's new. If you're newer to the network, you can always hit the subscription button absolutely free and accompany with the notification bell to get all the future updates as they roll out. Now these challenges are recommended at least 150 for your level. As you can see, very cool skins that you will be able to collect in the weekly completion rewards. You have the Omega exotic gears on top of the defended warrant of heroic and melee ranged. You can also see that the cosmic themes inside of the minor artifacts and 25 of the polychrons and 50 upgrade modules. The sequences for as far as the completions and the rewards is the one ISO 8 and the 10 upgrade modules. You can see tons of new stuff for as far as rare portions inside of these set descriptions that you get in cosmic perks and notable perks. I would definitely encourage you guys and gals to check out this article for as far as what's brand new for you to utilize as we scroll into the patch notes yes a double down a double feature it's like a quentin tarantino thing but we're going to be jumping off inside of there which we already covered for as far as briefly in the omega level threats for the family reunion you can definitely dive a little bit deeper multiplayer instead of the mega hive that comes a little bit more expansion for as far as the additional and the single player and you can have some more of the focus melees on other portions of the defense and that armor sets that they were specifically pushing boards for the strike teams and the remaining players in them. For as far as the temporary assaults, you can see that there are some stuff from AIM that you're going to have to accomplish within this Omega threat and the priority missions of that of the portion to 140. So definitely get this weekly portions of exotics and get out there and go out for as far as we are going to scroll into the reassemble campaign for as far as the Avengers initiative. So they have to tame a Titan and the elite is now visible on the war table for as far as the supreme mission change required to move the forward in the portion of the mission block. For as far as the Lives counter inside of the Mega Hive is removed. It has been replaced by an ability to utilize your hero who are at the uh, appropriate levels. For as far as Abomination and Taskmaster in the villain sectors, the adaptive adaptoids no longer spawn in the ceilings, which previously made it difficult to reach. The enemies now spawn correctly inside of the last avengers standing and inside of the forest hive beating the odds and the locations inside of the voices no longer let the plays at the same time inside of the english voice over and you can see that the fixed an issue in the mega hives where the defeated heroes would remain defeated or unusable even after starting the mega hive from the beginning Mega Hive also continues to have some issues with the heroes no longer abruptly appearing. There is a short pause between these. The multiplayer matchmaking for as far as beat the odds in the duration of the multiplayer, which audio no longer drops during the cinematics to take place in the right after defeating Monica. You can see that the arts and animations inside of Captain America for as far as Marvel's endgame outfit is now correct. You can finally utilize that for as far as the star face upward. On top of the Roy no longer appears customizable inside of the harm room. Don't worry, there's uh, some work that's going to be polishing that out. And Hulk performs the uh, child's play takedown. Uh, the enemy now files in the correct um, direction. The whole so situation goes to UI right after. As you can see that the opening and closing in the operation menus in the control players can now reopen the menu with a mouse gear and rewards come down to an epic hero set and no longer drops the stats if it was at power level one 
and known issues that they have with workarounds for everyone as we get to the tail end of this patch would be that the mega hive and the placeholder code incorrectly appears on the screen and the heroes selections menu after the hero is downed the code is supposed to show up when the players have 30 seconds to select another hero my life as the weapon in the mission incorrectly has a two piece of the shield gear as a reward instead of one piece so everyone I mean, that didn't seem too much like workarounds. It just seems like known issues, and that was just their bracket. But if you are new to the known work, you can always like, share, and subscribe. Absolutely free. Helps me out as a creator. And if you do today, who knows? Square Enix will continue to update, and I know they will, because we're going to be getting Black Panther within August. So definitely stay tuned for that. I'll be rolling across my channel when it goes live in the very early weeks, as we will start to see more expansions and more content come to Avengers. So everyone, have fun playing out there. Leave your comments down below of what you've been afflicted by, even with this update. What are you playing? Are there newer books that the company should be looking for? Let's see what you have to show in the comment board. Stay safe, stay classy, and I'll see you guys and gals in the near future.